Hey folks, welcome back to Let's Play Woe Long Fallen Dynasty on the Mysterious JG. Um, if Hong Jing slash Xiao Chan is to be trusted, we're about to take on the uh, creepy Taoist in black slash UG. We've been, uh, well, that's the thing. UG's done some terrible stuff, but like we weren't necessarily around for a whole lot of it. So it's a... Uh, it is kind of an important final battle, but it's not like we've been built up this huge rivalry. Uh, I mean, I'm trying to think. I, I keep... Th to me, this is the third Neo game. They just changed the name so they could set it in China instead of Japan. And the, the, the final boss of the main Neo game... Well, you had... Uh, you, you met him early in the game, and then, like, maybe once or twice throughout the story, you had that weird English guy uh, who was your main enemy... The final, final boss was, like, Orochi, a giant serpent demon, but I don't think that was telegraphed at all, and, um, it may be that we face UG here and some kind of goofy demon monster after him. And then in Neo 2, I guess the final boss was... Well, you fight that, and this again, it's just like some mysterious, unnamed, bad guy, priestly dude in black who had possessed, uh, your good buddy, uh, I can't remember if you, like, you were Hide, so he must have been, uh, Hisa Hide, or, like, he was, you were both one-halves of, uh, of, uh, what, oh, god damn, I can't remember his name now, Toyo told me, um, the monkey guy. But yeah, you, you're like the monkey guy who uh, becomes Emperor of Japan or like Shogun, kind of quasi-Shogun dude. Uh, and uh, yeah, you're fighting the guy who possessed him, but then he turns into some demon form, which I guess was the true form of that guy. So there was a little bit more of a sense uh, because you defeated them and now they were trying to possess you, so you were fighting them inside your own mind. So that one felt like a build-up to something that you had some personal... Uh, animosity with, but because of the fact that you had a mute protagonist, you didn't feel like you had that much animosity with anyone. And, and we've got the same problem here. The Taoist in Black slash UG has been a decent enough villain in his few appearances, but the idea that our protagonist has a real personal connection with this fight is pretty thin. Let's uh, stop talking and start shocking, as it were. See how this is going to go. Like, will we get any explanation and dialogue here? Is it just going to be, ha, 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 a few fools, I would destroy you, and then we never learn anything about what's going on. I like the way they've used Yao Chan in this. Honestly. You've made it this far. I dare say the fates favor you greatly. Yep. How well, they've it? always been found to me. Help me forge the ultimate elixir and join me in immortality. Well, you seem we'll trustworthy enough. Jin, lend me your aid. Oh, he you're here. Okay, so they're teaming up and doing magic shit. I guess she's not going to help you in combat then. Because the idea is how the hell would we defeat the dragon? So be it. I didn't say that. Then become a sacrifice on my path! Okay, I mean, no. So yeah, I, I have a feeling that metal will not be the way to go here. Either this is a really underwhelming fight when you have allies, or he is the first of more than one form. Missed my evade there. Oh, he's one of these teleport around bosses. Although the way the combat in this game works, we do tend to like, as long as I'm spamming buttons, our first sword strike will already be heading in the right direction immediately. <laughs> Yeah, 
Yeah, I'm sure this is a lot harder without Al. Damn, I keep missing that. Or maybe I'm succeeding and don't even realize it. Oh yeah, like this one. We just overcame it right now. I think I won that faster than you're supposed to, but again, allies. Okay. Doesn't feel like he's about. Well, no. Okay, he's gonna have a second form. The coughing of blood gave me a brief glimmer that it was actually over. The ultimate elixir rests out of my reach yet. Mm -hmm. But it is resting, so it's not you overtired. No <laughs> yeah, it's probably gonna be a lot harder to deal with when he's got a dragon helping him out. Because this guy, yeah, this dragon is in the cover art and. Oh, at least I don't have to go save her. Aww. It has come to this. Well, those are actual allies from Cao Cao's armies down there. Well, then you're not really offering your life, are you? It's a bit of a cheat. Well, anyway, he's turned himself into a demon monster. Go figure. Oh, man, he's, uh... I can't remember his name now. Dalgren and, uh... He's, uh, the, the dude who's, uh, the dictator of, uh, South Sandcott. Showing out in the forehead of his own demon. Okay, so... Again, probably not gonna be super useful to do, uh... Area of... Oh, look, he's touching the ground, though. It's not, like, guaranteed that this does nothing to him, although it's seeming unlikely that it does anything to him. Did I make a mistake somewhere? Yeah, you joined my forces instead of joining with this demon guy. Em okay. Embodiment of Demonic Key. I thought I was between them, but okay. We're finally getting some hits. Yeah, he, he seems like he's uh, unimpressed by our attacks. Ow. Yeah, and I'm going through potions like they're candy, and we're not damaging him, really. So I gotta land a few hits with poison on just to see if they if it even stacks against them, and I'm starting to think it's not. It's probably really important to get that uh, evade there, which I have not successfully gotten yet. Yeah, poison is doing nothing. Get you how doing back, but probably not really gonna help too much. I okay, well, he's not letting me do it anyway. Sorry about that. I'll fight doubly hard now. Cool beans. Yeah, I have yet to successfully time the evade on that. Oh wow. 
Now it shall take my time joining with you. This is tough going. Yeah, he's not uh not going down easy, is he? Not compared to the old man version. I can't fight. These wounds are too much. Thanks. You won't regret helping. I probably won't. I think having any extra targets around is good. Getting into the middle of them and okay, I finally evaded something. Getting being in close seems to be good for the most part. How doing alive seems to have been wise too. Okay. I'm trying to heal. I can't get free long enough to do it. Oh no, I'm out of healing. Jeez. That would be why. Okay, that could have been, I mean, we certainly did some damage. You see how doing a seeking aid, by the way. <laughs> It'd be nice if I could use Sin Jin and Sin Su here. They, they, uh, they got a beef with this guy. Their spirits could come aid us or something. All right, well, poison doesn't do anything. Now, uh, he may be immune to all spirits. In which case, only things that give us positive buffs will be useful. But he definitely wasn't taking damage from Metal Phase. Because it's not like he can be immune to poison and take damage from other stuff. That's kind of not how it works. Uh... So all the Wu Warriors and... I mean, I'd say we bring back the guys we've been using. Because Jia, or not Jia, you want, excuse me, uh, Zhang Liao and Guo Jia didn't really get a chance to do too much. Was it Guo Jia or Jun Yu we were using? Oh, I don't even remember now. But he's good with, uh, Guojia, so we use Guojia. It is so good to accompany such excellent talents. Yep. I bet. Okay, wizardry spells. I wonder if there's any wizardry spells we can. So we've pretty much learned all the wizardry spells. But some of them we can't use because we don't have enough points in those uh, things. So, setting wizardry spells. So, we're not going to get anything out of Toxin Wapit. So, I figure we might as well try... Granting your body has a positive effect that completely gets an enemy attack once. Oh, that sounds nice. That might be a good thing to use when it starts flat. It's a glowing nonsense. Uh, maybe do that at the top here. Is that one that we can or can't use? I think we can use that one. Then here I was thinking, because our best overall stat is wood. So maybe just use... Uh, lightning weapon. I don't know if it'll work on it or not. But it didn't seem to be using lightning against us. So there's at least a chance. Throws lightning bolt. Increase the accumulation of the time beast gauge. And then this was my uh, area of effect I'd been using. Uh... 
I don't think sand sink is going to work. Increases both the damage you deal to enemies and receive. That's C. If it was just the first part of that, I'd be a little more interested. Reduce spirit damage to from enemies. Grant single use effect that prevents your morale from... Meh. I think it'll probably be me trying to use Lightning Weapon and occasionally using Perfect Restoral if I think of it. Alright. Let's see if we have to fight both forms or just the uh, second form. First form didn't really cause us too much trouble. I'm still kind of hoping we can skip straight to the second form, though. Now it's loading up the cinematic because of the way I did this. All right, so we do have to beat them both in one go. It seems like. Your destiny has to become a sacrifice to Maybe we can electrocute him. Ow. I love that, uh, Zhang Liao's got his awesome mop gear on. Yeah, boy. Hurts the shit out of that darkness. I want to keep this uh, get health back when you attack thing active on my allies, like, a lot. Ow. And myself, of course. So I do get stuff from killing him. There are drops. Alright. So, yeah, skipping past these cinematics. Uh, that's a default. That's a setting I didn't put it on. So that we could see. Ow. Okay, that's a lot of lightning damage we got. This foe is no greenhorn. Do not let your guard down. I don't think it cares about any of our elemental damage. Until the very last moment! My body is so heavy. 
Well, Georgia, learn to love yourself despite your weight problems. I was overpowered. I don't know. You don't seem OP to me, Gorgia. You seem pretty, uh, pretty beatable. <laughs> you saved me. You have my thanks. You have our gratitude. Ow. Okay, I need to heal. I need to do this thing. The enemy strikes hard. <sighs> Alright, well that void, I didn't take damage that time from that thing because I had the don't take damage once thing up, but... You're keeping me entertained, but no one should take my time to eat you. Oh, Jang Liao's in trouble and I lost track of him. I think he's about to die. Yep, lost him. There's no more I can do. All right. Well, it'll be slight, slightly different from last time when Guo Jia was the first one down, and uh, Zhang Liao helped us till the bitter end. Can't freaking get to him to hit him. The enemy strikes hard. I know it does, Guojia. I'm trying to. Yeah, now it won't let me hit him. There we go. You saved me. You have my thanks. It is about time we bid our foe farewell. Beautifully dramatic music, anyway. Just too awesome. You and me, uh, guy from Ireland. <laughs> so heavy. My body's just so totally cool. Ow, fuck. I mistimed that. I thought I had him there for a minute. I didn't do as much damage as I wanted to while he was in that mode. Ow, ow. Where are you, buddy? I'll save you. You're the most important thing in my life, Gorgia. Help. <laughs> Sorry for being a burden. All right, so he's uh, throwing magic all over the place. I can't see a damn thing. Of course, let's fill the entire screen with bright flashing lights. Could you attack him, Guajia? Because I'm not getting any attacks in. Uh, it's not your fault, but it would be really helpful if you got some attacks in. A 
thought I might finally evade that. It didn't happen. My body feels like a sack of bricks. I'm sure I'm supposed to be doing a super on him here. Yeah. Oh, I even got to stab the 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 part of him that was still UG. I didn't realize UG was still sticking out of that guy. That felt more like a final boss fight. It's and that is the monster that is in the cover art. Hey, look, all of our uh, guardian spirit friends that I never used are here to help us. Like the game was supposed to be about us, JG. Well, Sun Tzu's Avenge, and so is Sun Jin, and a bunch of other people, as it turns out. Hey! All right, so that's what happened to the blindfold boy. It's he was really... He, they made him out to be really important, and then I thought he just disappeared. Lost. My brother can rest in peace. Rest in peace. Well, that's why we did it. For the spirit of Lu Bu's eternal happiness. Like, forget the fate of the entire world. All right, so the blindfold boy was turned into some kind of super demon monster dragon. And now we have two genuine key crystals, a dual reaper halberd plus eight, Haitian champion helmet plus eight, and Haitian champion footwear plus eight. And yeah... We only tried two elements against it, metal and wind, uh, wood. But I strongly suspect it was uh, going to be immune to pretty much all elements as far as extra damage goes. And that the tactic of, yeah, just pick spells that are going to give you a positive advantage was the way to go. Don't know how much we got of the drain life when you attack a spell. The next attack does zero damage to you. I feel like that was... Maybe that was a terrible choice, because I was constantly out of key from casting it, but it also, I think, saved us a couple times. <laughs> I'm so sad. Oh, my heart is heavy. Well, we will leave the rest to you and head back. But which one of us are you talking to? Oh, you're talking to me. You guys are heading back. Make sure to come and see how you're doing. All right, I'll leave my forwarding address at the post office then. Anyway, I'm going to go rule way and just kill off Cao Cao and take over. I've been dressing like him for a while now. Oh, so I'm just going to live here in the village with the blindfold boy? That's odd. <coughs> what the hell? Oh, looks like I'm getting demon fired. Oh, and I kidnapped the blindfold boy right under me fingers. Right under me nose! Remote Mountain Village, Langya State, Ju Province. They kidnapped him right out from under me nose. And of course, because I'm uh, Caucasian, these Japanese think that I have a giant horrific nose. And of course, they're Japanese, I've decided, even though this whole game is set in China. Well, I guess it's not quite over yet, but we um, got that blindfold boy's note part one. Tablet found in an abandoned village. It appears to have been writ left by the blindfolded boy. My family all had to flee from our home in another country. My father died and I was separated from them. But as the people in the village have shown me such kindness, I've been managing to get by. Although my brother Jin went to work for Wu, the yellow turbans rose up, saying they would create an ideal world. But there's no way they'll change things with their mindless violence. Even so, the House of Han will probably fall apart before long. One can only guess how this time of great change might develop. You can only guess if I accidentally had the identity of the blindfolded boy revealed to me. Uh, <laughs> but uh, I have a feeling it will be made apparent next time. Because uh, the game doesn't seem to be quite over yet. Uh, we also don't seem to have some place where I can go save, and, um, like, we have enough points to level up, and I'd like to spend them, but maybe we'll get to do that next time. I'll see you then, guys.